Hi there, this is the app web browser running on the Nokia N97. You can see here there's a tiny little blue arrow. If you click on it, you can see a whole list of controls. And if you click somewhere on the page, controls go away. So, controls up, controls away. You've got your back button, your forward button, your add bookmark, and then you can go to bookmark. Let's go to BBC. Here's a zoom bar, but it doesn't really work. Well, you can just zoom into pages just by double tapping. And while we're here, might as well demonstrate kinetic scrolling. Okay. This here is your refresh button. Click on that to refresh the page. As you'll also notice, it also acts as a progress meter and this little animation of this thing filling up um, changes as the page loads. You can also, for bigger pages, press press it as, it as it's also a stop button. This is a um, this is your address bar. You can type in it using the on-screen keypad, or you can use the keyboard. And annoyingly, when you close the N97, it goes into portrait. Even though I don't want it in portrait. Uh, there we go. Let's click back. As you see, it moves back and forth pretty quick. Let's open up some more pages. Is it loading? Let's click on this one. Okay, so we press back, back, forward, back. So it's pretty quick. So to get into the settings, you long press somewhere across the screen for about two seconds. So let's see. Yeah. Here you can go to the home page. You can access your settings, such as your home page, if you, can, if you want to block pop-ups, JavaScript, load images, Set flash to be enabled or disabled. And then your privacy privacy settings to um, clear history, bookmarks, cache, and so on. From there, you can also enable private browsing, and you can also access the help page if you're not sure about certain features. And you can also, oops, and you can also exit the browser, but we won't do that. Right. One of the cool new features of this browser is multiple tabs. So as you saw there, clicking that, you get this new layer on previous page. New tab, let's go on Amazon.co.uk As you see it's loaded the mobile version of the site. We can load the full site as we see it. And here's one tab. Let's open up another tab. Let's go. Let's go to one of the bookmarks again. And let's open. Let's go to the home page. So I've got three tabs. Is it four tabs open at the moment? Yep. So you've got four tabs open, it's this one window, two, three,
three, four. You can just easily switch between them just by tapping on those windows. That's really nice. Uh, if you want to exit tab, just close it with this here. I think the last thing to do now is um, flash. This is the mobile version of YouTube. Although it doesn't look like it's loaded flash, if you click on this, the video actually loads. Tapping it lets you go into full screen.